we just thought we'd show you what we're doing in our maths today and we are finding 10 less than different numbers. So you can choose a number from uh, one or zero to a hundred uh, and find 10 less than that number. Okay, and we've said actually the higher the better because it makes it a little bit easier for you. So um, we've got an example one on the board here. We've got 35 take away 10. Um, you can do this on a, on a hundred square. If you have a hundred square, we've looked at that before. Um, but if you don't have a hundred square and you want to draw it like we are doing at school today, uh, then you can do that as well. So I just thought I'd show you how to do that. So we draw the tens and ones for the number 35. So for the number that we know, the number that we have, we draw the tens and ones. So we've got three tens and we've got five ones. So I've got 35 drawn out there. And now we need to take away 10. So unlike yesterday where we were adding another 10, today we've got to take it away. So we said that the easiest way to do it is to cross it out. So you could get um, a different colour. Oh, if it works, no. Nope. You could get a different colour. You could get, um, if you're doing it with objects, you can then take your 10s object away. And we said we would just get a different colour and cross out one of our 10s. So we've taken away 10. And we then realised that the ones number doesn't change. So it's a bit like yesterday when we were adding 10 and the ones number doesn't change. It's the same when we're taking away 10 as well. So we've got 35 and we've taken away 10. So now we need to count them again to check how many we've got for our answer. So we've got 10, 20, and we've still got five. So we've now got oh, 25. So 35 take away 10 equals 25. And we'd like to say that over and over again, don't we? So that we practice that language that we use in our maths. Okay, so give it a go at home. Uh, we hope you get on okay. Um, and you can send in some pictures or anything of the, uh, the maths that you've been doing.